Okay. We're going to gonna try and show you here what's going on. Open up Excel. You'll probably notice this first one right away. Start your form. We're going by properties because that's the sheet name. And you can see here these are all your sellers, all your buyers. The reason these weren't checked off is because if you have a uh, merged sales there, which is one thing I've yet to figure out how to get around because you're not standardized in it. So we're going to go ahead and just try another one here. Now they work. The realtors I just did is so that eventually it will come up with the uh, company name. Address one, address two, uh, city, state, zip, phone numbers, stuff like that. Now we're going to check out how why you should never do keep everything in one table. As you can see here, I have four tables made already. And this is a query. I'll show you how I designed it. You can see we're hooked from agent number to agent number, which I really don't know what that is, but that's what you had on your thing. And this way we can separate everything that is different and make the data entry easier. And that's about it for now.